Hello and welcome. I haven't been making videos in a while, so let's take a look at this latest big feature in Shotcut. The feature is multi-select. You can select multiple clips, even across different tracks. So let's add a few video tracks and insert a few clips and take a look at them. Here we go, number two and number three. So what's going on here? We have three clips stacked on top of each other, and I can just select one and drag it, or I can select one and delete it with the delete key. But now I can also select all of them with Control A and delete them at the same time, or Control A to select all and then drag them. This is new. At the end of the dragging, they get released, which is a bit strange, I think. But it's a new feature, maybe it will be tweaked. Sometimes remove while uh, this feature, ripple edits across all tracks is enabled. Sometimes using remove might do the thing you want to do. For example, if I want to just move all these clips so that they begin at the start, or let's assume we have a split here and we want to remove this gap, you can. Let's not uh, select all because we don't want to move this. So let's control click these three clips and drag them so they snap to this one over here. Yeah, that's the thing you can do. In this case, I would, for example, prefer to use ripple remove, ripple delete. Let's uh, split these clips some more. Here we go. And rearrange them a bit more. Oh, whoops, didn't intend to do that. Didn't know that X does this. This is actually interesting to know. The way I work with Shotcut is uh, different from how other people use Shotcut. I prefer to work on the timeline. Others prefer to work with the source panel. I never use it. For my workflow, uh, the new feature is not all that useful because it lacks uh, basic features like dragging a square, uh, I mean a rectangle around clips to select them. I cannot do that yet. And uh, dragging makes the selection disappear, which is strange to me. What if I want to drag them a little and then and move them a little more? I'm very used to be able to drag a selection box and also that my selection gets saved. But this might be extremely useful alone for dragging multiple clips uh, between tracks. Let's see, is there... I don't think there's a select all on this track feature. Is there select all? Well, there's select all. Also, you can deselect with control D or right click, select none. So this is the new feature. Let me know what you think about this. I mean, I, I'm excited that this kind of usability is being added to Shotcut. I look forward to future versions and also future improvements, especially on making uh, more common selection features available. Not sure if this is on the roadmap, but I hope so. I will be making another video with looking at more features of Shotcut uh, shortly, I hope. Until then, ciao.